welcome back to the channel. So I see a lot of questions with these OCB buckles. So I just want to make a quick video showing you how to thread and use one of these. They're relatively easy. It just takes a couple times practicing with it and you'll have it down. So I'm going to show you, I'm going to bring you in real, real close and I'm going to show you how to actually thread one of these. So this is what you're going to want to do in order to thread this. So we'll call this the front side of the strap, the side that has the hook on it, right? So this is the front side of the strap. This is the back side of the strap. And here's your buckle, right? We're going to call this the back side of the buckle. And this is going to be the front side of the buckle. The front side has the metal, the metal latch piece. So when we go to thread it through, the buckle itself, we're going to want it in this orientation. So go ahead and get your, your strap, face the hook away from you to the back side of the strap, and go ahead and follow it all the way down. In your hand like this, face the buckle this direction, thread it through the front side to the back, and then the back side to the front. And what this is going to allow you to do is when you throw the strap around the tree, you're going to hook the metal piece into there, and you'll cam the buckle over. So I'll go ahead and throw it on the tree and show you one more time. Alright, so I like to throw the hook part of it around the tree. And then you have the hook facing towards, uh, towards you. You go ahead and put the metal latch in there. Pull your slack out, but you don't want to pull too tight because this thing will bite down pretty hard. See, that's a little too tight. Back it off a little bit and cam it over. And then in order to actually get it off the tree, just go ahead and place your hand over it and pull the tail. So I'm going to go ahead and thread this through uh, the back side of my camera arm and show you how that works as well. So in order to actually thread this through this base, um, when you're looking at it on the tree, this is kind of the right side, this is the left side. So we're going to flip it over and we're going to be working from this side. And we're going to bring the strap in from this, uh, this way. So on the base, there's two little slots. There's one here, and then there's one over here. So we're going to thread it through this way and we're going to come out this side. So again, we're going to work with the back side of the strap and the hook away from us. We're going to follow this all the way down. And then we're going to take the base and we're going to feed it through this slot. This is extremely hard on camera. So then you'll go ahead and you'll feed it in through this slot and then out through the other side. Go ahead and pull it all the way through. So still working with the back side of the strap and our buckle facing this direction. We'll go ahead and feed it through the thicker of the two slots from front to back. And then we'll go ahead from back to front and feed it through the smaller of the two. So then when you get to the tree, this is kind of how this is going to work. Alright, so you're going to have your camera on base. You're going to have it you're going to push it up against the tree with your body like this. You go ahead and throw the buckle around. Go ahead and just try to keep it as flat as possible. And then you will go ahead and hook the little metal piece right onto that hook. And go ahead and tighten it down a little bit, but not a whole lot because you don't want to bend these legs or you don't want to bend the talons on your arms. So, kind of go ahead and get this position where you want. But you're going to want, I mean, you're going to want quite a bit of slack in this thing. And it's okay because you'll be able to, with the ease of adjustment of it, it's going to be no big deal. Once you get it where you want it, go ahead and cam it over. And then you can go ahead and just tuck the strap wherever you need to. And this thing is rock solid and it's not going anywhere. And then one more time, just with the uh, with the buckle part of it, just so you can see it. So with the hook facing out, you'll go ahead and bring your buckle in and hook the little metal latch onto the onto the hook. 
and then leave it just a, you're going to want a little bit of slack in this thing and then go ahead and cam your buckle over and like i said leave a little bit of slack in it because look how look how rock solid it makes this thing it even digs the digs the talons right in the tree so you don't want to bend those I hope this short little video helps you kind of figure out this little buckle system. Once you uh, once you use it a couple of times, it's not not really that difficult. Good luck this season, and thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.